too time-consuming, too expensive, too complicated. Many body composition measurement methods are unsuitable for use in everyday medical care. Nevertheless, patients in poor health should be examined regularly. Patients who suffer from renal failure or muscle wasting, who have heart defects or are anorexic or obese, they all need affordable and precise diagnostic support. Almost all body composition analyzers, BCA for short, currently on the market are not appropriate for such cases. They are simply not accurate enough for medical purposes. But now Seeker has developed a BCA that is precisely tailored to the needs of modern medicine. The Seeker M BCA. The M stands for medical. The first device in the world for measurements in the standing position that measures body composition with medical precision. Seeker had results from its measurements validated and correlated in international clinical studies based on the recognized medical gold standard. The principle of the measurement is based on conventional bioelectrical impedance analysis. But the qualitative difference between the Seeker MBCA and previous devices lies in the formulas used to analyze the extensive measurement data. The formulas deliver exact and reliably reproducible results. And they even take ethnic differences into account. I believe this impedance measurement is a genuine medical advance. Now it takes just seconds to weigh a standing patient. We all know that being overweight is a big problem in the developed world. In the US and Europe too, up to 30% of all patients are too heavy. The advantage that bioelectrical impedance analysis has over other body composition methods is its utility. That is, any doctor can use it and any patient can be examined, except for those who wear pacemakers. The examination is not invasive, so it's no problem for the patients. The process is fast, and as soon as it's over, the doctor receives all the information he needs to make decisions about a patient's treatment. Before the Seeker MBCA could deliver medically relevant measurement data, Seeker had to forge new trails in device development. International clinical studies were conducted on the device, and today, Seeker is one of the first manufacturers in the field of measuring and weighing that has validated its bioelectrical impedance analysis against the gold standard. In our study, we use different reference methods. We started with densitometry, a hydrostatic weighing method to determine body density, for which we used air displacement plethysmography. Then we used an X-ray absorption method called DEXA. We also determined body fluids, that is, total body water and extracellular water with two dilution methods, deuterium dilution and sodium bromide dilution. The last method we used was magnetic resonance tomography. Individuals of the same age, gender, height and weight, but that differ in ethnicity, have different body composition. So if we take, for example, a male, 25 years of age, um, we were to compare a Caucasian and an African-American male, two males. What we would typically find is that the African-American male, for example, would have larger amounts of skeletal muscle mass than a corresponding Caucasian male, even though their height, weight, age is the same. As a follow-up to the two landmark studies conducted in Kiel and New York, medical researchers had to clarify the question, what exactly are the reference values for a healthy status? A team led by Dr. Piner of the University Medical Center in Hamburg investigated this matter. They ascertained the body composition of 1,000 blood donors with the Seeker MBCA. The objective of this study was to put together a control population that would help us find a standard distribution of values for some special parameters in bioelectrical impedance analysis, the phase angle, the bioelectrical impedance vector analysis, and the so-called body composition chart. 
der vorhersehbare medizinische Nutzen The foreseeable medical benefit from measurements made by the Seeker MBCA device is a better assessment of the actual volume status of dialysis patients. Reaching the therapy goal of a uvolemic state, the normal body fluid volume, goes hand in hand with positively influencing the morbidity and mortality of these patients. So the Seeker MBCA validated in clinical studies was brought to a completely new medical level. An MBCA device that delivers medically relevant data. Reliable, based on validated predictive formulas, ready for integration in medical practice routines, developed with state-of-the-art medical measurement technology. The handrail has importance for um, let's say populations or individuals who are frail or perhaps sick that at the time of measurement are not that able to stand unassisted. The handrail allows for greater reproducibility uh, with respect to the positioning of the arms. Devices that let you measure a standing individual are particularly interesting in areas where there isn't a lot of time for a body composition measurement. In a perioperative setting, for example, where a lot of discussions have to take place and many examinations have to be made. In that situation, a fast and valid measurement of body composition is very attractive. The Seeker MBCA helps to detect abnormal developments long before the individual complains about the first symptoms. As you know, one of the main health problems in our society is diabetes mellitus, a serious metabolic disorder and not just a question of high blood sugar levels. We will be happy to see the Seeker MBCA device contribute to the goal of identifying at-risk patients. It would be great if your average man or woman could step onto such a scale and see whether fat mass or muscle mass are all right. And for our dialysis patients, this information is of course of vital importance. Seeker MBCA. It helps you to assess the health status better, faster and more precisely than ever before. To recognize disorders early and to successfully monitor difficult courses of therapy.